the whole school had a chance to space. have a go at I looking at tours. So we wanted to actually create with it. So I came up with the idea that use our PBL, which we were introducing at the school from last year, to use the 360 photos and incorporate some little animations or animated characters to show the rules across the school. As it was the beginning of the year, it was a really great time to reinforce what was introduced last year with our new school rules of being safe, being respectful and re being resilient. And the different ways that we show this in the areas around our school. For the new kindergarten children coming through and even for the younger students here, sometimes you know there are, new, there are different things in different areas that we don't realise. And so it was a good way to, for the children to pick a space in our school with one of the uh, 360 photographs and show their or apply what their knowledge is of the rules in that area. Uh, we made a virtual reality representation of our school rules. We use 360 degree images. We use artificial characters uh, to represent bad and good behaviours. So we felt this was important because we could use artificial characters uh, to show bad behaviour instead of not real people. Uh, we use digital generated characters so um, they could last forever and they, can't, they also can't uh, graduate schools as well. I'll be going to Year 7 next year, so I know that this will help future students. I chose the library and I included a lot of 3D models. You had to show that you had to be quiet in the library and that you, where you borrow your books and um, where you stay if you want to read a book. I thought it would be helpful for other students to see what it would look like. It was very fun because we could incorporate things that you wouldn't normally have. We chose a virtual reality experience for them to show their PBL rules. It gave us the opportunity to use environments or true environments around our school and blend it with some artificial characters that could show positive and some negative behaviours around our school that we wouldn't otherwise be able to show. I like putting the people in and imagining what they would say. I like putting in sometimes bad behaviour because you wouldn't normally be allowed to do that. We could do things in virtual reality that we would not be allowed to do in real life. I think this is a good way to show it so people could see what it looked like. Uh, sh sharing information this way could be helpful to other students. We had students that would that work together that re that wouldn't work together in other situations, but the VR really brought them together. Our projects are now showcased on the school website.